Tigers hosting the Blue Jays, and the Blue Jays are minus 110. On the money line, the Tigers are minus 106. The over-under is 8.5 runs. The Blue Jays, laying a run and a half on the run line, are plus 142, meaning if you bet them that way, they must win by two or more. And the Tigers, getting a run and a half on the run line, are minus 172, meaning if you bet them that way, they must win this game by two or more. And damn, was I wrong, because the Blue Jays opened up a can of whoop-ass on the Tigers today. But, you know, shit happens. The weather for tomorrow's game is supposed to be, when the game wants to pull up, 81 degrees, 8 mile an hour winds blowing in, and no rain. Manoa pitched twice against the Tigers last year. Six innings, one run, one earned. They won 12-2. He struck out eight. Four and a third, three runs, three earned. They won nine, three. He struck out three. Manning pitched twice against the Blue Jays last year. Six and two thirds, no runs, no earned. They won two, nothing. He struck out five. Six innings, four runs, four earned. They lost nine, three. He struck out three. Head to head, the Blue Jays are on a two-game winning streak. The Blue Jays are seven and three. The favorite has won the last two games they've played against each other. The favorite is 7-3 and three on the money line. The favorite or the underdog getting or laying runs is 5-5. Five and five. There have been two one-run games in their last 10. The under is 7-3 and three in their last 10. The under 8.5 runs is 7-3. and three. The road team is on a two-game winning streak, and the home team is 5-5 five and five in their last 10. And like I said, they played today, and the Blue Jays won 9-1. The, uh, the Blue Jays are... One and two in Manoa's three starts this season. His last two starts, though, he's gone seven innings. The last game was, shut, uh, was a shutout. The game before that, three runs, but none of them were earned. And then his first outing back, he got lit up like a pinata or by a, like a pinball machine. Seemingly, he's come back to down to, like, earth. Manning, they are two and three in his last five starts. The over has hit in his last three. The over is three and two in his last five starts. Five and a third innings pitched, 6.2 hits, three earned runs, 4.6 strikeouts, 2.4 walks, 0.6 home runs, 87.6 pitches, and 16 pitches per inning. The Blue Jays are five and five in their last 10, three and one in their last four. The under is six and four in their last 10. The over is hit in their last two. Seven runs, five runs, 11 runs, 10 runs. Five runs and a win, shut out and a loss, and then back-to-back -back games where they scored nine runs and one. For the Tigers, they are three and seven in their last 10. They're on a five-game losing streak, and the over is eight and two in their last 10. The over has hit in their last two, four, six, seven games. 11 runs, 13 runs, 11 runs, 10 runs. Three runs and a loss, three runs and a loss, three runs and a loss, and then one run and a loss. I am going to take... The Blue Jays with the money line. I will take the Blue Jays laying the runs. And I'm going to lean over in this one just because the Tigers' bullpen seemingly keeps falling apart. These are just my picks. If you disagree, please go with your gut and please bet responsibly.